Layering clothes is a skill that can take even the most simple outfits and elevate them into something stylish. This can be applied to any style of dress, whether it's casual, formal, or anywhere in between. I was the guy who would throw on an old graphic t-shirt and old tennis shoes and call that a casual outfit. All of that changed when I met my best friend, who told me I needed to put more effort into my style choices. He didn't give me any chance to argue. He just showed up one day and started showing me how to layer the clothes I already had, and he completely changed how I interact with people. Suddenly, I'm getting compliments on how I look, and I have never felt more confident. So now, I'm paying it forward and sharing with you everything I learned from my best friend and style mentor. Keep it simple. Simplifying your wardrobe is the first step to mastering the art of layering your clothes. What does this mean? It means cutting out a ton of clothes that don't lend themselves well with a clean-cut, layer-ready wardrobe. This does not mean you need to throw out a ton of your clothes, just that they should be worn strictly for times and places where appearances don't count against you, like at the gym or lazing around at home. The first thing you would want to do is to separate your solid color shirts and your jeans. These pieces are very classic, as they do not have ugly logos or designs that distract or take away from your outfit. They are also very easy to layer. Note, there are some people that enjoy a maximalist approach to dressing, and there is nothing wrong with that. However, it can get much trickier to find complementary pieces to layer along with bold and vivid prints. If you want to wear a print, like camo trousers for example, then it would be wise to wear classic solid-colored tops and overcoats as well. Shoes should also follow these guidelines of being clean, solid-colored, no logos, so that you can pair them with many more outfits. Versatility and comfort can make a huge difference when it comes to shoes as well. A nice pair of dark-colored loafers for semi-formal wear, dark dress shoes, clean sneakers, and boots are some basic essential shoes that will go a long way in a man's wardrobe. Keeping all of your clothes and shoes clean and ready to wear is a great rule to keep in the back of your mind. You never know when you'll need to do a quick change and go out the door. Time and place. When planning any outfit, keep in mind when you're wearing it and where you're wearing it. This means knowing the time and place that something is appropriate. Certain events and locations have dress codes, and unless you're a rich and famous movie star, you are not cool enough to ignore these dress codes. This can change what pieces you will layer and what clothes you need to have in your closet. For example, let's say you're invited to the opera. What are you wearing? The correct answer. An elegant suit or tuxedo with a long overcoat over it. However, this isn't the only place a long coat can be worn as a fashionable and practical piece. As the winter winds cut through the crowds of people, using a long coat as the top layer can work even as the days start melting into spring. This can be done by wearing a simple long sleeve beneath it as the base layer with jeans and sneakers. The overcoat will elevate the entire look, taking it from basic to stylish. However, this can go the other way if you switch out the long coat for a puffer or denim jacket. Suddenly, the vibe is completely different, and you're wearing a casual, more basic outfit that you can wear on errands or meeting up with friends. Gym clothes are only appropriate in the gym. Unless you are a gym influencer, there is little reason to be wearing those clothes anywhere else outside of perhaps a hiking trail. Sweatpants and basketball shorts are extremely comfortable, but not a real outfit you can walk around into a restaurant or to a grocery store without getting some dirty looks for your disheveled appearance. It's important to keep in mind you can run into anyone, at any time, and you should always look presentable in public. There are a couple of key things you need to remember when you're trying to put together a nicely layered outfit. What fits you, and what's comfortable. No more than three layers. Everyone has seen that classic episode of Friends, where Joey wears 20 layers of clothes as he struggles to get dressed for an event. Why did he look terrible? He broke the no more than three layer rule. Of course, some might make an exception to this rule if they're living in Antarctica and Alaska, but for your average man, this is a golden rule. Not only would more layers hinder your freedom of movement, it would make you look bulky in an unflattering way. The main reason for this rule is also about more than just a nice fit. It can be quite overwhelming to the eye to see an outfit as cohesive or elegant when it is looking at more than three opposing fabrics and styles. Keep in mind the weather as well. In the summer, only two layers are fine, with open and airy pieces like a tank top and a thin long sleeve left unbuttoned over the top. 
a casual classy summer look with two thin layers. You do not need more than three layers if you feel your layering is missing something, then perhaps you should switch out one of your pieces for something with more texture or with a print to add a splash of pizzazz. Never forget that you need to go from the thinnest layer on the inside to the thickest to the outside. Colors Everyone needs to be aware of what colors look best on them and their skin tones and hair colors. For example, lighter colors like baby blue can be very hit or miss on pale skin, but almost always looks wonderful on darker skin tones. Taking a look back at what looks best on you can be as easy as recalling what color you've been complimented on in the past or doing a professional color analysis. However, if you're not sure what colors look good on you, keep it neutral with colors like black, white, charcoal, and other neutral shades. This not only looks good on everyone, but it will also give an air of subtle masculinity that is very attractive. It also makes layering very easy as the darker shades are placed as an outer shell that protects the rest of the clothes and fit. The colors you choose can change with the seasons as well. For example, more niche colors like emerald greens and ruby reds are more fashionable during the winter months, while pastels are popular in the springtime. So long as you are able to choose the appropriate way to mix and match dark and light shades and how they interact closely together, the sky's the limit. When layering your clothes, keep the darkest colors on the outside and the thinner, inner layers as the lighter colors. This is a basic guideline that can be ignored as you grow more confident in your layering skills. Tan overcoats can be really nice over the top of a dark-colored outfit if coordinated carefully. Self-confidence The best accessory you can wear is a smile. This is also right about self-confidence. Being comfortable in your skin and positive about where you are and what you're doing is contagious. This kind of attitude will make others react to you with the same energy. This is all a matter of habit and routine to maintain a positive mindset. One way to keep up with this standard is to make your self-care a priority. And my favorite way to start the day in a good mood is to complete my daily skincare routine that makes sure my skin stays clean and fresh every day. Introducing Tish Anley, the easiest skincare for men on the market. This is a monthly skincare subscription line for men that caters to every need with ready-made systems to choose from on their website. It cuts out all the unnecessary steps of a typical skincare routine and makes it easy to keep up with your hygiene. Simple, inexpensive, and effective. They even send along a card with instructions on how to use their products to the best effect. Tish Hanley offers a great deal of customization and they let you decide how often you want to receive it in the mail, with no hassle at all. You can pause or cancel the subscription whenever you want, so there's no need to fear any shady scams or waste. Made with a lot of natural ingredients like eucalyptus and rosemary, this will leave you feeling refreshed and nourished while staying fragrance-free. The entire skincare routine takes less than 5 minutes every morning and night, and it does not take up a lot of space in your bathroom, unlike some of those ultra-expensive and wasteful skincare lines today. This is something you can easily implement into your daily routine. They even have systems focused on men who struggle with acne, offering two different systems to clear up your skin. You can also check out their bundles which will save you some money. There's an affiliate link in the description below of this video. Go and check it out. I hope this layering guide has been helpful to you. Keeping these five tips should help you on the way to mastering the art of layering clothes and elevating your everyday style to something masculine and attractive without hiring a personal stylist. Make sure that you subscribe and follow for more lifestyle advice and content.